Okay, let's begin our conversation about function-oriented search. We will talk about function-oriented search, but I must say, function-oriented search, it is only small fragment from more broad tools, for more broad platform for solve a problem in, in the trees. And I define it as a uh, method of analogy, or uh, there is other term, uh, we can use term, clone problems approach. FOS는 한 가지 음, 더 포괄적인 에너지 유추 또는 쌍둥이 문제 클론 프로블럼이라는 더큰 방법론의 하나의 구체적인 세부 방법론이라고 볼수 있습니다. Clon problems have four important mechanism uh, in this uh, methodology and function oriented search it is only one mechanism. But I'll show for you today briefly four full mechanisms also. Including functional idea you understand. You uh, try extract solution from one industry, from one industry, and deliver this solution to other industry. It is main idea of method of analogy, main idea of functional oriented search also. 한 분야 내가 지금 풀고자 하는 문제는 뭐 지구상에서 처음 푸는 게 아니라 이 세상 어딘가에 언젠가는 누군가 풀었었던 문제다. 특히 파 분야에서 네, 그게 주 생각이죠. And most of all, we talk not about method of invention. We, we must talk about transferring of solution from one industry, one industry to other industry. It is very attractive, and I will show why. I'll show for you what is mean uh, Harpoon machine th theory approach. I'll show for you what is mean application of function oriented search platform. I'll show for you how you can use physical contradiction for uh, solve a problem via approach of clone problems, via approach of method of analogy. I'll show for you. Uh, uh, I'll show for you how we can use trends of engineering system evolution for solve a problem. Uh, and uh, how we can use combination from these tools in, in real practice. Okay, method of analogy. Uh, okay. Let's begin from some easy experiment. Uh, I'll show for you, I'll show for you pencil. I'll show for you pencil. And when I use this pencil, my pencil, my pencil will be finished. Okay, I need repair my pencil. I need move something, uh, uh, deliver a small portion of substance for continue my main function. My main function, add substance to surface of paper. But if you consider <coughs> this part of technical system, this part have absolutely opposite function and you must uh, use this, uh, this part of technical system for remove, for eliminate substance in surface of paper. But anyway, sometimes you can obtain situation when this substance will be finished, and you need delivery new portion of this substance, right? And we have two working tool, and two working tool have similar problem. And you know how we can solve a problem for this working tool? We can solve a problem very easy. Uh, we can use we can use. Special device for this, right? This device in here. Thank <laughs> you. 
You know solution. We can deliver a new portion very easy via using of dynamization. But how we can solve it? How we can solve this problem? It is similar problem for this system. Similar problem. I, when it finished, I need delivery new portion. And you can see, it is really possible. And you see solution. Absolutely similar solution. Two absolutely different function, but absolutely different solution. What happens in this case? In this case, we solve a, we solve a problem for a riser. Solve a problem for a riser via existing solution from other area with absolutely different fun function, by the way, with opposite function. Uh, and uh, we call this situation, <coughs> we call this situation disadvantage-oriented search. Uh, and in this situation, you can do interesting conclusion. If you see similar problem, you can use similar solution. And it is main approach, uh, main approach for you know, cloning problem platform, main approach for uh, classical trees, by the way, also. Uh, and later I'll show for you how you can recognize it in classical trees also. Okay, what does mean method of analogy? Method of analogy, it is a situation when you can try similar solution, when you can try similar situation from other industry and define, uh, define what, was, what was similar. And when you do this definition, you can, uh, you can extract information about a uh, method of comparing. Uh, let me, let me uh, refresh your knowledge from uh, mathematical logic. In mathematical logic, in mathematical logic, we have very easy, very, very easy uh, set of equation. You know, if some object equal to object, if, if object E equal to object B, or object B equal to object C, you can do conclusion. Object E equal to object C. Remember it. It is very popular, very popular love from logic, uh, love, uh, love of transitivity. But in this case, very interesting situation. What is meant equal? Equal, it is some process of comparing of two different objects. And for compare different objects, you must select some criteria for comparing. And in our case, in this area, when we talk about, uh, when we talk about criteria for comparing, we can talk about Similar function, and it is function-oriented search. We can talk about similar disadvantage. Similar disadvantage, similar solution. You remember previous example. And we can talk about disadvantage-oriented search. Similar physical contradiction, similar solution. And in this case, we can say about new approach about using of physical contradiction. We can say about similar scenarios. When we talk about scenarios, it is trends of engineering system of evolution and 40 principle. And you remember, when you studied 40 principle, very often you obtain situation. You, you learn one principle and you can see, in every example, we had similar problem, similar initial problem. And every similar initial problem was solved via uh, recommendation by, by this principle. Next, when I begin to talk about similar disadvantage, please remember today's experience. Uh, today we considered several examples uh, for application uh, trimming, methodology trimming, by ideal final result. And you remember, in our morning's examples, we had similar problem. Remember, similar problem with, uh, similar problem with uh, pencils, similar problem uh, with tooth toothbrushes and spoon. We, if we had similar problem, we can, uh, we can apply methodology of similar solution. 
And by the way, when we uh, study level one education, you remember about matrix of Alshula. Yeah? It is matrix of Alshula. Uh, majority people don't like it because um, for flyingly apply uh, matrix of Alshula necessarily go to high level of abstract. The people don't like to do it. And it is the reason why uh, why matrix is not so much popular and more easy use step by step 40 principles. But anyway, what is mean matrix of Alshuler? Matrix of Alshuler, it is uh, storage of situation with similar technical contradiction. Right? You can build technical contradiction from one industry and found some recommendation and found some solution. We can build technical contradiction in absolutely other industry and found here some cells and extract useful recommendation and update some, some solution. And by the way, matrix of Alshuler, it was first step in the trees for follow to logic uh, similar, similar problem, similar solution. It was fundamental trees, if you can see the history of discipline. Okay. <웃음> 아까 연필 샤프 뭐 지우개 이야기할 때는 문제점이 동일한 종류의 문제점이었죠. 문제 그러니까 유사한 문제는 해결하도 유사할 수 있다. 그래서 다른 타 분야 해결안을 가져오면 된다. 타 분야 해결안을 가져와야 된다는 사실 자체를 모르는 사람은 없습니다. 너무 다 널리 알려진 건데 타 분야로 하면 망망대해인데 세상은 넓고 분야는 많은데 어디 가서 뭐 어떻게 가져와야 되는지 그 가이드가 없으면 아무짝에도 별로 신고가 없습니다. 근데 그 힌트가 될수 있는 어디 가서 찾아야 되느냐, 어느 산에 가서 찾아야 되느냐에 대한 힌트가 될수 있는 것들이 똑같은 문제점을 가진 분야로 가야 되고요. 어, 똑같은 기능을 일반화된 똑같은 기능을 가진 분야로 가야 되고 특히 그 기능이 더 중요한 분야로 똑같은 기술적 모순을 가지고 있는 분야 문제 사례를 찾을 수도 있습니다. 모순 행렬이 이 케이스죠. 기술적 행렬, 뭐 사, 서른아홉 카페 같은 중에 어, 13번째 파라메타를 계산하면서 17번째 파라메타가 악화되는 그런 기술적 모순을 가진 경우의 데이터베이스가 알트슐러도 있었겠죠. 그 경우에 이런 발명 원리를 써라. 왜냐하면 똑같은 문제니까 해결하고도 비슷한 방향으로 나올 수 있다. And by the way, remarking this point, you see several categories, similar function, similar disadvantage, similar physical contradiction, similar scenarios. But uh, I refresh your knowledge about ideal final result. When we use ideal final result, first step, we must define disadvantage, right? I refresh your knowledge about technical contradiction. Technical contradiction include disadvantage also, because you remember what does mean technical contradiction. You select some parameters, you try improve these parameters, but something other parameter have deterioration. Yeah, it is disadvantage. And you use couple parameter and one parameter, it is disadvantage. One parameter, it is plus, other parameter, it is minus. Disadvantage. But when we talk about physical contradiction, we have absolutely similar situation. We begin to define similar contradiction in this case and touch this box and ah, very hot, very high temperature. Yeah? And you can immediately build model of physical contradiction. What is important parameter? Important pa parameter it is temperature of surface of vessel. And you must think, oh, temperature must to be big, temperature must to be low. In this place, in surface. And you can solve it via principle number three, and you can use local quality regarding to parameter of temperature. But anyway, you begin your reasoning from bad situation, from problem. You touch and obtain and obtain uh, obtain bad feeling disadvantage harmful field we call this disadvantage harmful field harmful thermal field and main conclusion disadvantage it is more fundamental categories in analysis when we do analysis as physical contradiction and technical contradiction and ideal final result because we begin think about ideal fun, final result, about technical contradiction, about physical contradiction, only after definition of disadvantage. Please keep it in your brain. And when you do functional analysis, 
you follow two fundamental categories. You try to define every disadvantage from existing options, from existing process. And you remember the main theorem from uh, process of invention. There is only one way for create invention. Necessary define some disadvantage, necessary kill this disadvantage, and you will obtain invention. I don't know other way how we can do it. And let's return to function-oriented search. And function-oriented search compare object via criteria similar function. And when we do this comparing, we can use this comparing for search interesting solution and do transferring solution from one industry to other industry. Let's consider, let's consider uh, situation cutting all grass and situation using of a right process of shaving. It is cutting of grass and it is cutting. But not grass, cutting of some sticks, cutting of hair. But similar work. And according to, according to this hypothesis, we can extract solution from agriculture area and deliver this solution to uh, shaving area. And opposite, we can extract some solution from shaving area and deliver this solution to agriculture area. Let's check it. It's possible or it's not possible. It is possible, believe me. And you can remember, remember evolution, evolution of uh, system for cutting of grass. And next step of evolution, it is using of revolving knife. But absolutely similar scenarios you can found in evolution in evolution of uh, system for shaving. Okay, theoretically. We can extract solution from system for shaving and deliver this solution in agriculture area, and we can invent this land, land mover because this land mover has absolutely similar principle of operation. Can we do opposite way? Can we extract from agriculture area some solution and deliver this solution in uh, area for shaving? Yes, it's possible also. <laughs> And you can see, in agriculture area, we have land mover with spiral knife. When you push, when you push this land mover, spiral knife revolve. And spiral knife revolve and cutting from grass. Can we use this principle of operation for create new product for shaving area? Yes, it's possible. And you see, there is a real product. It is new product uh, in, uh, to, in today's market. This product, it is shaving system. It is two rings with big amount of holes. And when you move, when you move your finger, you revolve these drums and you do cutting of, cutting of hair in surface of face. 
It's absolutely similar principle of operation so here and here. Here you move, and here you move, and do cutting. 별도의 동력으로 돌아가는 모터로 돌아가는 게 아니라 사람 손가락이 밀면 그 힘으로 이렇게 돌아가는 간단한 전기 면도기가 전기 가지고 면도기가 있습니다. 똑같은 카운터 파트죠. 비슷한 솔루션이 안쪽에 다 있습니다. Okay, let's consider some practical recommendation how we can apply the function oriented search in the practice. Step number one, we must define main function. It is, looks like as in function analysis. We define main couple of operation. We define main function of main function of technical system. And yesterday we had you obtain experience. You remember our exercise how we can define main function for uh, different technical systems. After this, necessary define root function. After this, necessary uh, define root function. And via root function, you will go to more high level of abstract consideration. You can see. Where I can meet this example, this function in other industries, and you will go to <coughs> other industries, and you search according targeting search uh, system <coughs> with similar function, with similar root function, and after this you found some prototype, and you will return in your industry, and you will try do implementation Im implementation of this prototype, and most of all this process will be success because you touch and you catch existing solution. Not fantasy. You touch existing solution in other industries. It was applicable solution. And it is a big reason when you follow to logic of function-oriented search. You use not logic. You use not your knowledge in physics or in chemistry. You use your knowledge about existing solution in other industries. Implementated solution. And it is big, big attractiveness because you dramatically reduce a risk of a risk of uh, bad idea. Obtain not uh, maybe maybe beautiful but not work not workability idea, not applicability ideas. Okay, let's consider situation with applications this in the practice. We can consider real real project. It was my project many years ago, before my transferring to Korea. It was before 2005. Uh, and in this project, we must consider, we must consider some uh, situation. Situation is very easy. In cosmetic clinic, doctor must deliver cosmetic substance to surface, to surface of skin of patient. And you see real process. Doctor delivery, doctor delivery substance. Doctor to do treatment of skin. I have traditional question for you. What do you think? What kind of disadvantage you can recognize in this process? Help me. What your opinion about disadvantage? By the way, uh, Possibility very fast define disadvantage. It is uh, very important part in solving because a uh, big amount of uh, not success project correspond with uh, low possibility user of trees see disadvantage. What kind of disadvantage you can find here? So what what can be better? What can be bad? It is, it is my traditional question when we build function model, right? First question, please define main couple of operation, main couple of interaction. Next, colleague, what can be bad? What can be bad here? It takes long time. Huh? It takes long time. Yes, of course. Yes, of course, because Doctor, doctor spent long time for delivery, for delivery liquid to surface of surface of face. Okay, good sir, good answer. What else? What can be bad? Drop the liquid. Drop the liquid. Absolutely correct. Doctor can randomly bloop and deliver liquid to surface to surface of face of patient. Realistic, absolutely realistic. Because doctor, doctor, it is people. 
And people can do uh, randomly, uh, randomly not correct movement. Thank you. What else? I ask you. Absolutely correct. Non-uniformity, because doctor can forget how much substance pass me money. How much substance located here, how much substance located here, and in one substance it it, it, it can be excessive amount of substance, in other substance it, it can be uh, insufficient amount of substance. Because big distance the doctor can can forget about. Okay, we define three disadvantage. It is important because when I'll show for you solution, we will check this disadvantage was um, uh, uh, eliminated or not eliminated. Okay. And after this, we must follow to uh, our algorithm and define uh, what can be main function. Main function not easy defined. Yeah. Delivery at subs at cosmetic liquid to surface of skin. 여기 지금 필요한 이 분야의 구체적인 기능은 뭐냐면 이 분야 용어를 그대로 쓰면 됩니다. 화장액을 미용액을 어, 손님 얼굴에 골고루 바른다. 미용액을 손님 얼굴에 바른다. 이렇게 기능이 되고요. After this, we must to do step number two and define root function. Definition of root function today more easy create because yesterday you obtain explanation about it. Yeah, what is mean root function and I not will say, Kali, how much function you can imagine in your mind? 1,000, 500? No, you know answer. Uh, after inspection of this question by uh, Yuri Fedosov, we know exactly, in practice of application in function modeling, we use commonly approximately 100 verbs. And some verbs use very, very popular. Some verbs use very, very seldom. And after continuation of inspection, we define, oh, there is six important verbs who used very often, and you remember our yesterday explanation. It is verb move, add, remove, hold, reflect, deflect, and transform. And it is most of all popular verbs in, in function model. And you know links between these verbs because yesterday you obtained explanation. There is, uh, there is platform of dialectic, and according to platform of dialectic, we must select some polarity categories. Move, and what does it mean? Not move, polarity category, stop, hold. What does it mean? Add, add substance, and what, what can be polarity category? Removed substance. Our discipline correspond this dialectic and you know uh, application of uh, dialectic approach uh, many times in building of function modeling or in a set of 40 principles. For example, in 40 principles area you can find huge amount of principles with absolutely opposite recommendation. Principle 38 recommend for you increase dramatically concentration of oxygen. Principle 39 recommend have absolutely opposite recommendation. Please decrease the amount of oxygen. Or principle 13. Principle 13 consists only from polarity categories. Principle 13 recommend if you have increasing temperature, think about decreasing temperature. If you have uh, location of some problem in all inside, please think about outside. And next, next, next. Polarity category, uh, categories, it is, uh, it is our style. It is our fine done. Uh, and by the way, in our yesterday exercise, you obtain you obtain list of function, and in every cells you have most of all popular work from this list. Yeah, 
Move, add, remove, hold, uh, deflect, reflect, transform. But for every, for every verbs, you can find some synonyms. And why was selected this verb? Because this verb has more high level of abstracts. For our word in function-oriented search, it is important. Because step number one, we must define our main function maybe with some synonyms. Step number two, we must go to high level, high abstract level and select, select main verb with more high level of abstract consideration. And after this, we will go again in practice flat and we'll go as an industry and search, uh, search system and product with similar function from previous industry, from your industry, from your problems. And according to this situation, not so much difficult was create classification system of root function. And you see this classification system. In this classification system, we have six important work with high level of abstract consideration, and we see three categories of operation. It can be category substance, field, and information. And you can multiply, you can obtain only 18 root functions. 18 root functions, absolutely enough for uh, follow to logic of function-oriented search. And uh, when uh, was visited this classification system, trees expert, professional trees expert, begin immediately seen. It is not infinitely amount of function. We can consider every function and we can create special electronic database. Because uh, why I will spend my time for go to Google and think about other industries? We can create database for every, for every function and in every cells we can collect, for example, 100 examples. And it can dramatically accelerate process execution of project because if I define root function, I can open special database and I can select some suitable examples. It was main idea five years ago, four years ago. And we begin follow to this idea, and today we collect full, uh, we collect big amount of examples for every cells. In every cells today in electronic database located 25, 35, 40 examples. And total amount of examples in this database approximately more 450. It is really dramatically, dramatically can accelerate uh, execution of project. But we, uh, we randomly define other side of this database. When I explain for beginner approach of function-oriented search, for beginner it is easy for understanding, but not easy for implementation. And we can dramatically accelerate experience of beginner if beginner will to do 18 exercise step by step. If you remember example, you can remember this example in during execution of projects also. And one year ago, <coughs> in this conference, we created a report together with my uh, scient uh, scientist partner, Sergei Ikavenko. And Sergei Ikavenko, some co-author from this approach. And by the way, Simon Litvin was uh, some little bit co-author also, because Simon considered consider this system. Uh, had criticism and we improve this system after your criticism. And we define other, other way and we explain this way for every beginner colleague. There is electronic database and if you need increased level of your creativity, please welcome in this database. Please spend 18 days and in every, in every exercise you must read 25, 35, 40 examples, and you need understand it very well, and you need insert in this database your personal example. And if you insert, you will obligatory memorize content by this set of examples. And after 18 days, you will be absolutely ready to work in professional area via implementation of function oriented search. Please remember about this opportunity for you. Uh, Emin Yu yesterday showed for you link to this electronic database. And it is free of charge because uh, we think 
uh, it is ca uh, ca cannot to be uh, uh, charge. It, it must be free of charge because uh, trees, it is science. And in science, impossible uh, create hidden result. Necessity shows this result for every people and obtain some feedback from other people's thoughts. And, okay, let's return in our project. We define main function as adds uh, cosmetic liquid to surface of skin. Absolutely not difficult to define, define location of our root function in this uh, classification, in this uh, classificator. Add substance. Okay, and after this we can open cells about add substance and select some suitable prototype. And by the way, this example, some examples from our exercise, yeah, what does mean hold of substance, and every system in this picture have function hold of substance. You remember yesterday's exercise. I know you will repeat it today. Uh, and <coughs> you see some useful equipment, useful equipment for coaching, and you see this equipment here. It is cube for you know, create for create uh, exercise in function oriented search. If you obtain uh, home education about function oriented search via eighteen exercise, we can collect together and I can do very fast exam. I can show for you some side of this cube and you must show your examples. Okay. And you see uh, suitable set of verbs with synonyms and with main function. You have this list in your tables. And by the way, believe me, uh, it is a set of recommended verbs for building function models. Because I mentioned every verbs from this list correspond with changing of some parameters. And if you will use this set of work, you will follow to experience of professional tree solvers. And professional tree solvers build function model more fast as beginner. And you see several examples from this cube. What is meant add, what is meant move. And it is a small piece from collection for every, uh, for every example about remove, about add, about the flag, about transport. Because transport,它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的话，它能有两个人的
the spoon explain for you different scenarios. And let's return in our let's return in our project, this cosmetic liquid, and we open database and we select from our database several suitable several suitable prototype brushes. Uh, it is uh, cylindrical brushes from construction area. Uh, it is uh, soft pen. It is printer printing system, and it is ball pen. Yeah? Oh, really? Ball pen, interesting. Every every prototype is interesting. But when we select ball pen, we can define in cosmetic industry existing solution. We do it obligatory, and. Eight years ago, when, uh, when uh, was execution uh, of this project, uh, this solution was exist. And in this solution, uh, we, we solve our problem. We use a revolving ball, we use full contact, full contact with uh, cosmetic liquid, and when we move it in surface, we kill our disadvantage long time, we kill our disadvantage delivery randomly liquid to surface of uh, to face of patient, and we kill your disadvantage about non-uniformity because you see immediately uh, amount of substance. And by the way, it was first evidence about uh, about applicability of our approach. If we select full pen and we check Google, we found this solution. Okay, it is it is correct way. It is existing product and it is evidence. Approach is correct. Approach follow to success. Regarding. <laughs> 없으면 이제 새로 발명할 수 있는 기회가 있는 거고요. 있더라도 타 분야에 있으면 그래도 발명하는 기회가 있는데 뭐 80%가 기존 분야에서 많이 있었다. 그러면 너무 실망하지는 마시고 그 그게 우리 방법론이 워킹한다는 걸 증명하는 걸 수도 있습니다. 트리즈가 실질적인 해결안들을 다시 재발명할 수 있다는 걸 보여주는 거니까. And after some analysis and some comparing, was selected as main prototype software. Oh, so pen existing solution, and why not? We can use this solution for try to do implementation about delivering of cosmetic liquid. And you see final solution. In final solution, it is existing product. Today you can find this product in every pharmacy in Russia. This product delivery cosmetic liquid to surface of pressure. And it was uh, it was applied in practice very fast because uh, big attractiveness of function oriented search you show for customer existing technologies. If it is existing technologies, you must think <coughs> about adaptation. Adaptation it is very small money for R and D. If you invent absolutely new principal operation. You must think about creation of new equipment. You must spend big money to R&D. In function-oriented search, we have opposite way. We use existing equipment. We use existing technologies. And these technologies can help for us very fast to do implementation with high level of probability of success. And finally, finally, uh, ah, um, very often customer very often customer ask us oh it is good solution can you found uh, can you found for us other area of implementation for this solution uh, and uh, several years ago was created a special tool and we could tool this we call this tool reverse function oriented search or opposite function oriented search target if you have some technologies, please try search other industries uh, where you can do implementation of these technologies. Again, you can use electronic database, and if you define your root function, you can open your cells, and you can see list of industries. 
And via list of industries, you can find immediately area for application of your solution. Uh, and uh, it was a similar situation uh, in this project. Customer immediately begin think, begin ask, please find other uh, other area for implementation. Uh, and first step, we begin think, <coughs> okay, cosmetic liquid, but we can think about perfume liquid. In perfume liquid, you know, we have spray. Spray can deliver a nice smell to surface of body. But spray have some disadvantage. Spray can put to eye randomly. And if you will use this system, this system cannot randomly deliver uh, substance in, in eye or in uh, the surface of other peoples. Uh, and first idea was uh, use soft pen for delivery nice smell to surface of girls. Again, we will begin to check, begin check, we begin check uh, Google, and we found an existing product. This product was created in American market, and you see perfume soft tip pen. Our idea was not fresh. <coughs> uh, but we uh, begin continue our search, and we define new area for implementation. New area for implementation, not so much difficult to define. You can uh, open a uh, database and you can find, for example, nicotine patch. Nicotine patch have absolutely similar function as delivering of substance. And nicotine patch have similar function. Nicotine patch delivery for you substance via surface of, uh, via surface of uh, skin. Ah, and next idea was Let's consider nicotine patch. Nicotine patch have some disadvantage. You know this disadvantage if you try apply it. Uh, after 35 minutes, you obtain irritation of skin. <coughs> and you have uh, need removed it. But if you will use, uh, if you will use uh, high concentration of nicotine, and if you deliver a high concentration of nicotine, you can, uh, you can do avoiding of irritation you can immediately obtain uh, enough portion of nicotine for your organism. And you can see, we uh, define this area and according to, according to this situation, we consider situation using of high concentration of nicotine and high concentration of nicotine we can deliver in surface of smoke. Uh, what can, uh, where can be area of application of this idea? As you know, uh, in uh, aeroplane area, uh, very often you have long, long trip in aeroplane. For example, duration, duration trip from Seoul to Moscow, it is nine, nine hours. For smoker, it is very long time. And many company, many company spread for passenger nicotine patch. Uh, but uh, our customer begins see, oh, we know area of application and we will try deliver this product in uh, aeroplane company, in traveling company. Well, it was idea of our customer, but uh, I don't know exactly uh, uh, what kind of success of our customer in this case, but uh, after, uh, after some inspection, after testing, uh, specialists define, yes, it is a realistic solution, we can, we can, apply, we can apply these tools also. We can apply this equipment for uh, traveling companies also. But you see how we can uh, how we can apply function oriented search. We can apply it for two sides. One side search solution in other industry. Other side it is polarity side opposite way. Via this approach you can find solution from other industries. And it is final final slide from this theory. Step number one you define main function. Step number two. You search prototype. We are using of root function, and we are using of uh, we are using of uh, electronic database. Next step: selecting of some most suitable prototype. Next, and, and last step: implementation of this prototype in a real situation. Not difficult. Not difficult theory. And uh, we use this approach in every our project because uh, um, we must do execution of project very fast. Yeah.
이렇게 쭉 가서 볼펜 구체적인 해결안 중에서 4분야에 있는 볼펜이라는 해결안을 선택할까 했더니 이미 기존 발명에 있었고 소프트펜을 한번 발명해 볼 어, 소프트펜을 써보고 적용해 볼까 했더니 우리 분야에 없어서 물론 이것도 약간 모디파이를 해야 되겠겠죠 가장 미용액을 하기 적합하도록 뭐 그래서 오염이 되면 안 되고 뭐 이런 실험 매직 같은 거야 오염돼도 상관없고 변질도 안 되고 하지만 여러 가지 개표가 있겠죠 그래서 우리 분야 해결안으로 응용 개발을 어, 하겠죠 이렇게 가는데 때로 눈 거꾸로 가기도 합니다 발명이 시작되고 나서 내 분야의 해결안에서부터 다시 출발을 해가지고 또는 뭐 지금 발명해서 나온 해결안이 아니라 지금 발명해서 나온 해결안이라면 뭐 식시마로 따지면 개선안 확산이라는 게 있잖아요 이 개선안을 타 분야 다른 라인에 뭐더 확산을 할수 있을까 이렇게 하는 건데 다른 시장 다른 용도 다른 시장 용으로 할수 없을까 응용 개발할 수 없을까 그걸 따지는 건데요 어, 네 분야 해결안이 있어요 그러면 이 해결안은 무슨 구체적인 기능을 해결하기 위해서 해결된 거냐 어, 저 개발된 해결안이냐 그거는 추상화시키면 또 어떤 기능이냐 그런 기능을 필요로 하는 타 분야는 대표적으로 뭐가 있냐 그 중에 제일 돈을 많이 벌수 있고 우리 제품을 개조를 개선을 덜 해도 되는 게 어떤 분야 비슷한 분야 같은 거냐 그대로 적용할 수 있는 게 어디냐 찾아서 타 분야의 해결안으로 어 약간 응용 개발을 했겠죠 이 과정에서 그렇게 해서 하는 게 리버스 FOS입니다. 리버스 FOS. 그래서 어 이거는 뭐 필지 과제 끝나고 나서 마지막 단계 하셔도 되지만 사실은 요즘 기업들은 기술 특히 뭐 중소기업 같은 경우가 더 심한데 크게 R&D를 하거나 할 여력이 없어요. 그렇죠. 우리가 하고 가지고 있는 기술은 이거밖에 없어. 우리가 이미 투자돼서 설치돼 있는 라인은 이거고 우리가 할수 있는 건 이거밖에 없는데 이거를 다른 데 팔아먹을 수 없을까? 그거는 투자 별로 필요 없이 바로 돈이 떨어질 수 있는 그런 방향입니다. 그래서 리버스 FOS 새로운 시장을 창출하고 인접 시장을 창출하는 데 되게 유용한 투자 별로 없이 신시장을 창출할 수 있는 방법이고 그 과정에서도 기능을 추상화하는 이런 스킬이 필요합니다. 그래서 미용액을 바른다, 액체를 바른다, 물질을 바른다에 따라서 점점 더 멀리 있는 이웃 산업 영역을 찾다가 더 멀리 있는 산업 영역을 찾다가 이렇게 합니다. Okay, let's go to next topic from our lecture, but we will do it after break. Yeah. Yeah.